Good morning and welcome to Nissan. It's been two years since we first announced our Nissan Intelligent Mobility Vision right here at Geneva. the boundaries of EV technology, doing what others said we couldn't, electrifying and regeneration. The future of Nissan Motorsport, the all-electric, all-powerful, Nissan Formula E. This intelligent mobility is this intelligent mobility is all great. Sorry. You got it? Got it.
A couple of weeks, first of all, just trying to get delivery and design uh, done as this is a real departure from what we've been doing with, with GT cars. Th this car provides a completely different landscape and, and, and canvas on which to draw. So the design team has been doing a, an amazing job to, to come up with something new and exciting for us. But, but then again, that's all on computers or on paper. When you first see the car physically, the size, the shape, uh, it's a whole nother level. Yeah, well, unlike a, a regular formula car, which is completely streamlined, or a GT car, we have this big canvas on. This, this car is full of shapes and curves, and um, it, it's, it definitely presents a challenge. Uh, it's an opportunity, but for the guys working on it uh, on the, from the livery, and I can expect for the mechanics later on, it's definitely going to give uh, them some, some exciting work to do. Well, the, the design inspiration, I mean, the designer said that the first thing they, they thought about when they, when they saw the car was a, more of a, a sonic, sonic bird flying through the air and, and this idea of the Doppler wave and this, this sonic boom emanating from, from a point in space. Uh, and I think it captures the car exactly, exactly right. And so then the livery and the colors are all reflecting ar around that theme. Um, I think uh, people will pick up on the design cues, especially with the uh, accent striping around the front and the side of the car and, and certain colors. Um, even even the, the tones of the colors are, are similar to uh, Nismo, Nismo brand. Yeah, well, we're very, really fortunate. Uh, not only have been we been working intensely with the design team in NML, but Matsuo-san has come over from Japan specifically to, to work on this um, day and night uh, to make sure it's exactly the way we want it. And that's the kind of commitment we have on the team. I mean, everyone from engineers, to designers to mechanics, uh, everyone wants to do their part and every part is important. So we're, we're, we're really grateful and appreciative of that. The final cherry uh, on the cake will be seeing it in, in Geneva. I mean, every day is rewarding and, and making this happen is, is, is something that we all love to do. But I think Geneva, the unveil uh, and actually seeing it on stage and, and not just not us seeing it, but everyone else seeing it, I think is what's exciting. I mean, we, we're working with it every day, but I think the, uh, the opportunity for the rest of the world to see you know, the first Japanese manufacturer uh, in Formula E, that's exciting. So there are, there are two big reasons why Nissan's entering Formula E. Uh, the first is off the, off the back of the really successful launch of the second generation uh, Nissan Leaf, the world's best selling EV car. Um, we, we were looking at the motorsports landscape and Formula E is at the perfect time to join our EV road sales and our passion for motorsports. So Formula E gives us the perfect opportunity to really launch this and, and to show people that we can only be sales leaders in road cars, but we also want to compete with this technology and to make sure people understand that this that EVs are can be fun, exciting, uh, and bringing them right right to them in the city centers. So I'm here to wrap the graphics for the upcoming uh, Formula E. So we are really excited to do this project. Yeah, so to be honest, I think this is a really nice shape. So we are really excited to do a very new, excited graphics on this vehicle. So the historically, the first, uh, first step is uh, to think about the brand color, but uh, this is a new generation. So therefore, the first step was uh, we needed to think about a big theme for this graphics. So we just come up with a really one unique idea that was a sonic boom. Then, so after that, so how to make it real? That's a process. The theme is a sonic boom. So sonic boom is a sort of uh, air. So we, how to express uh, the air in this car? So otherwise, uh, we do not have uh, any clear line. So we have a lot of uh, graduation uh, from uh, one point to the split out to the air. So how to make it? That's a challenging point. 